was its origin. Uh, and we, we will explore uh, the various layer, layers of the dark that make up the dark web uh, infrastructure. Next. And this is a photo which can give an explanation of the webs. And there are three parts. Uh, I give an iceberg as an example. And the first part, the top of the iceberg, is the surface web. And uh, it's the internet we wish to use, and we, as we know, which we use, as we know it. And our Google uh, browser, such as apps in uh, surface web. web. And there are so many people have a common mistake that to think uh, deep web and dark web are the same. It's not the same, it's different. The deep web is the, uh, set in the middle of the iceberg and it can represents about 90 uh, of total con internet content. It's, yes, it's very uh, big part, it uh, organized big part of the iceberg and this is the uh, very, very bottom part of the dark web. It's the dark web, the very, very bottom part. And it uh, represents about 5% of the internet content. And there are not any indexed, uh, there are not any indexed uh, search engines, and it's banned part of the web. Next. Access to the darknet side. Uh, as you know, as I mentioned, this is banned website, and you cannot access by your by our regular browser or Google. Uh, only exactly this program can access and show you how to with with it into the website, and only um, it's an application, right? Yes, it's application, uh, and it's uh, this. Next one. Uh, the darknet sites. We, uh, we, find, we always find the sites with, that end with com, net, etc. But the darknet sites end with onion. And you can, uh, there are so many illegal uh, substances such as illegal weapons, drugs, depraved videos and contents and disgusting contents too. And so many people deliver uh, illegal uh, weapons or such as uh, drugs. They always deliver, but the police officer think that uh, purchasing the illegal substances in street is more safer than uh, deliver by uh, like uh, by uh, this sites from these sites and uh, the, a bunch of uh, students at Mas uh, Manchester University were arrested after making fusion uh, with illegal substances like this. And they were arrested. They were. Uh, they were. They were arrested for. They sentenced it to five years. They were sentenced to five years. Yes. Next, one, please. This is the most dangerous part of the website. It's hackers. Uh, the hackers always send you uh, unusual and interesting links to attract. And if you press the link, they connect uh, your gadget or your mobile phone or computer camera to their computers, to their computers. And uh, one day, one uh, 14 years old boy decided to go on this website and someone sent him an uh, unusual link. He pressed this and then he saw uh, one girl's account which uh, named Demonize192. Uh, they, uh, the guild sent hello. Uh, the boy replied to. Then suddenly the guild sent a video me video message and with a note, I'm watching you. And uh, I saw the video. It was really scary, so I didn't send this. And it was banned content too. 
and uh, police officers and FBI always inside this uh, inside this uh, sites too. They control and they try to manage uh, to know and they interact the users URL. And it's ex extra information. Of course, I don't really advise you to visit in this website. But if you uh, visit in this website, you must turn on the VPN. Without VPN, your URL cannot be anonymous. The VPN make you anonymous. And next one. This is unclear part of the web. It's red run. It's uh, really. Um, uh, it's unclear. Why unclear? Because there are there is some credit of uh, evidences to support to support uh, that uh, existence of such activities. But uh, I'm gonna tell you the occasion. What occasion happened in this room? There uh, stand there stand for executioner. Executioners are killers, maniacs. And one uh, kidnapped person stay on the chair, and you will be uh, in live stream, and you uh, pay for the maniacs and order to what to do. For example, break her neck, break her finger, or break her throat, or you can kill them, but you lost millions, millions of your dollars. Next one. Uh, it was the end part of my presentation and thanks for your attention.